What's up guys, in this video I'm going to be talking about iBlank. Now iBlank is a pretty old tweak, but was recently updated to support iOS 7. So as you can see here on my home screen, I do have a blank on or in between my app store and game center. So iBlank is usually used for when customizing your home screen in case you want like all blanks in the middle or just blanks on the left and right hand side of the home screen. So as you can see here, it's just a blank icon. And if you were to tap on it, nothing happens. So if you're interested in getting this tweak, all you gotta do is go into studio, go to search, and you wanna type in iBlank for iOS 7. You're gonna get a really long description there, as well as some few screenshots. But once you have it downloaded and installed, you're gonna get a new icon on your home screen called iBlank. And from here, you can select how many eye blanks you want. I believe the maximum is 100. So you pretty much got a load of options here of how many eye blanks you want. And normally, when you're creating eye, uh, blank icons, you will have to, or it will respring your eye device, pretty much. So there's also the option to delete the icons. It will remove all the icons created on your device instead of having to, you know, individually closing them out, which is which can take forever. So, let's just say no for now. In the middle, you have the information, iBlank 5.0. And the left side is the Facebook page for them. But that's pretty much it for iBlank. It's a pretty useful tweak in case you do like to customize the look of your home screen. In case you want it to look like an H or just any type of letter or a design that you want. And yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please click the like button. If you have any more questions, post a comment. And if you want to see more videos like these, please subscribe. Thanks.